guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're welcome. Today we're going to be a little vulnerable with you guys. Um, I wasn't planning on filming today, so I'm not in camera, which is why we're just kind of staring at Potato right now. So, as you guys know, I'm trying to get a room tour up for you guys. I said like two more videos and it'd go up, but honestly, I hate my Crested Gecko enclosures right now and Percy's enclosure, so I'm redoing them today so that they look just as nice as all the new enclosures. So I'm going to take a step back and I'm going to show you what the Crested Gecko enclosures look like right now. Because you guys saw when they set up, or when they were set up, and it was all live plants and looked beautiful. I can't keep live plants alive and honestly these backgrounds didn't hold together very well, especially Pip's. Hers look horrible. So we're going to take a step back and I'm going to show you these enclosures now. Normally this isn't what you see from pet accounts on Instagram or on YouTube. Usually you only see the pretty good setups. You don't see the setups that didn't work. So I'm going to show you my setups that didn't work and they look horrible. So I'm going to show you what they look like now and we're going to completely redo them so they look nice again. And I mostly got plants that I know I can keep alive, that way they <laughs> do better this time around. So let's take a step back. Okay, so here are my Crested Gecko enclosures. Obviously they look like crap. The only plants that have really survived in here are the snake plants, as you can see. Um, I ended up putting these fake bromeliads in to add some color because just everything died. She's got these fake pink plants to make it look nicer. I also tried to fill this hole because I hate that she hid in it. I could never get to her. Um, Potato's got this plant that does really well and it starts not doing well like you can see it is right now. And then all of a sudden it does really well and then it doesn't do well. Pip has this plant over here that is like completely dead now as you can see but it was doing so well out of nowhere it got nice and big and it looked great and then all of a sudden the other day it just died <laughs> dead so it looks like crap um I said this before you guys know this is the first enclosure I ever did a background in so as you can see it does not look very good so yeah I honestly don't like these enclosures after upgrading my other animals. These just feel really small to me. So I do have plans for future enclosures for them. They're going to move to white PVC enclosures. And they're going to be much bigger, wider, more spacious enclosures. But obviously I don't have room for that right now on this shelf. So it's a future project. So for now we're just going to redecorate these enclosures and get them looking nice again.
I already cleaned out Pip's. I'm pretty sure she's hiding in here, so I can't move it yet. But I want to move it up in this area so it's not in the way of the plants. Um, but yeah, I think she's inside of it. Not totally certain though. 